Hi guys, here in this video, I am going to show you that how you can display the products on the basis of your color variants. So, for example, you have a product and it has four colors, and you wanted to display all its variants on the collection page or maybe on the products page. If you are interested to show all its variants, then you need to add some code and it will be solved. So this video is specific for uh, impulse theme. So if you have any older version or maybe the latest version, so in both the cases it will work. So if you are uh, watching this video and you have any other uh, theme, then I have also uh, created the videos for those. Uh, so if you are not able to find that video, you can contact me. I am giving the contact details below in the description. So you can directly contact me and I will send you the code. That's it. So first of all, uh, we need to go to our dashboard. So here you can see that I have already installed impulse theme. So here you need to click on the, these three dots and I have impulse theme uh, 6.0.0 version. All right. So you need to click on these three dots, click on edit code. I will be giving the link below in the description. So you need to download the code first and then after you should go to your uh, snippets, scroll it down. And here you will be getting product dash grid dash item dot liquid. So this is the only file where you can actually modify the code. So I have already added the code because of which on my uh, store it is uh, working fine. All right. That means it is appearing. Uh, it is displaying all the uh, variants of a specific product. For example, I am selecting this product and you will see that I have blue, red, yellow, black, green. All the colors are here. All right. So all the colors are also displayed on my catalog or you can say that uh, for example, this is the catalog. So here we have displayed all the products. So all the products are displayed. But along with that, we have also uh, the variants. For example, we have different colors. So on the basis of those colors, products are also displaying. So what is the benefit of this? If you are marketing a specific product and you wanted to display all its uh, colors. So in that way, maybe the customer is selecting any specific color. He or she likes any specific color. So in that way, you have to actually showcase all the possibilities. So then after what uh, I'm going to do here is uh, I'm going to undo the code first. So for this example, this is the original code. Let me save these changes. And once I saved these changes, let me refresh this page again. And here we go. Now you can see that I have all the products which has only single variants displayed over here. So like we have the shirt which, uh, which has multiple colors, but only one color is displayed. All right. So how we can actually solve this issue? So the first thing is we need to download the code. I already mentioned you that, for example, you have uh, any older version. So you need to uh, you will have these two files. All right. So you only need to uh, replace this uh, file. I'm going to open this code and I need to copy all the uh, code from here. Let's copy this and then after paste it into this file product dash grid dash item dot liquid. So inside of this, first of all, you need to select and delete. Then you need to paste that latest code, which you have copied and then click save. All right. Once you are done, then you need to refresh the page and the products will be appearing here. So that means this is working fine. What is the other case? For this example, you have the latest version of the impulse theme. Then you will have to do two additional things. The first thing is like you have to create BG set dot liquid. So this is the snippet actually, which you have to create. I have already mentioned in the documentation. So here in the documentation, you will uh, have to create a new snippet and name it BG set. So how you can do that? You can copy this name and then after you need to go to the files again. So here you can see that we have the snippet. Click on add a new snippet and here you need to uh, put that BG set. All right. Then you need to click on done. Once you are done, then what you have to do is you have to open this BG set dot liquid and then copy this code. And then after you need to paste it here. Once you are done, then you need to save these changes. And what additional thing you have to do here is you have to replace this code with uh, the different code, which is this one product dash grid dash item. So this is also the another code. All right. You have to copy this and you need to 
paste it here select and delete everything and then paste it once you are done then click on save changes so this is how you can actually uh, do the modification in your older version oh sorry latest version so that way your impulse theme will definitely work if you still facing any issue then then you can contact me i will be adding contact details below in the description so you can contact me anytime and if you have any other theme you can also mention me i will create a video first otherwise i will definitely help you out all right if you have any other suggestion like you have any problem and you are using any app and you uh, are really suffering from losing the money so definitely i will be providing you the custom code which is definitely helping you out why because this is one time investment you only uh, just uh, getting the code and uh, putting into your files and then you are done you have no need to install any additional app all right so thank you so much for watching this video if you are thinking this video was useful then please like this video and also subscribe this channel thank you once again see you in the next video